Hi guys, I'm Megan Graham and I am here today with my dog Alfie and we are here to talk to you about our favorite Yorkie grooming supplies. So I love to come to you with my Yorkie 101 videos because my mission with my YouTube is to teach you guys how to have a happier and healthier life with your pets. Yorkshire Terriers are the absolute best dogs that I could ever dream of having, but they need a lot of care and I've done a ton of research about their grooming supplies and a lot of people have been asking me about what is the best Yorkie shampoo, so I just wanted to share with you some of my very favorite products today. If you haven't already taken a moment to subscribe to my channel, please do go ahead and subscribe to my channel and also let me know if you have any favorite Yorkie grooming supplies. Today we'll be talking about what's in my Yorkie grooming kit and we'll also be talking about my favorite Yorkie detangler. So I've been buying tons and tons of different products for years and testing them. Every single week I do my live stream where I talk about different grooming techniques, products, and I answer questions about your Yorkshire Terrier puppies. And again and again, people have been asking me to link to some of my favorite products. So I just wanted to take a few minutes to talk to you guys today and explain why and when I use various products. So first and most importantly, you're going to want to get a great toothpaste. This has been a fantastic one. It is an enzyme toothpaste and I always use it for my dogs. Just so you know, I'm going to be linking to everything below. This is a non-toxic toothpaste, so it's not going to harm your pets, but it's also something you're going to want to get in the habit of doing constantly to keep their teeth nice and sparkly and healthy. Along with the toothpaste, I found these amazing tiny toothbrushes. I'm going to be linking to these below, but as you can see, it's got a teeny tiny head and it is perfect for reaching into those little Yorkshire Terrier mouths. Okay, so now for the fun stuff. As you can see, Alfie has a lot of hair and so he needs a lot of grooming and some special tools. So when I'm grooming on a daily basis, I often use a detangler. Here is a great one. It is by Isle of Dogs, and I'm going to be linking to that on Amazon below in the description, so all of this will be really easy for you to find. Now, if you want to go the more natural route and not use any synthetic fragrance, you could also go with Espana Silk. Espana Silk also has a detangler. It does not have any artificial fragrance, so it's really really up to you which one you like to use. I'm really sensitive for artificial fragrance, so I usually use the Espana Silk version. Now, when I'm grooming on a daily basis, I mainly use two combs. I know that some people use brushes, but I find that you can really get into those little hard to reach areas like under the arms and things like that by using a comb. So this is one of my very favorite combs, and as you can see, it has a tighter side on the bottom and a looser side on the top, so the prongs are actually differently spaced. I use this all the time. I mainly detangle them with the larger side, but occasionally in a pinch, I use the smaller side to clean out the area around their eyes. I'm going to be linking to this on the description again. This is not available on Amazon. It's by a brand called Madden, and I'm going to be getting it into my online shop soon, but for now, I'm going to link to someone else's shop that has it. This is the second comb that I use, and this comb is fantastic for getting out the Igu that Yorkies, Maltese, and all of the small dogs tend to get. I always comb very gently around the eye area because you want to make sure not to poke them in the eye as you would never want to be poked in the eye either. Um, this is a fantastic comb, and I usually put these in my dishwasher about once a week just to keep them clean and crud free. As you can see, I did not do so today. These are the band scissors that I use. They are also by the brand Madden, and I'm going to be linking to them as well. I will be getting these in my shop, but I don't have them yet. They're nice and curved, so you can slip right in and cut out their little elastics without cutting their hair. I also always keep around a nice rat tail comb. You can use this to section their hair to put a ponytail in. You can also use the metal part to gently pull their little ponytail. Oh, you didn't like that. To pull their little ponytail, just so it's a little bit fluffier and it's not too tight. And then I have bags and bags and bags of these snag-free elastics. These are amazing, and it's really important that you use snag-free elastics on your Yorkie. They're very, very tiny, and I will tell you, make sure to change their ponytail every day. You wouldn't like to wear a ponytail for days and days and days, and your Yorkie does not either. 
So when it comes to actually cleansing your Yorkie, there's a few different things that I use. One of my very favorite brands is Isle of Dogs. And I will tell you that inside of this, I actually have their puppy shampoo, which is a tear-free, non-irritating shampoo. It's in a different container because I actually empty several containers into a larger container that has a pump. I find it so much easier when I'm washing my Yorkies to have a pump as opposed to picking up something that doesn't have a pump. So that's kind of a pro tip, but when you are washing three Yorkies, as I often do, the easier it is, the better. From Isle of Dogs, what I also tend to use is the heavy conditioner. This is fantastic for getting through tangles. If you have a dog with finer hair, you will not need as much de um, heavy conditioner, but this works so, so well. Now these do have a synthetic fragrance, so sometimes I use them and sometimes I don't. Lola is very, very sensitive, so I often use something that is completely natural and fragrance-free on her. As far as a fragrance-free shampoo and conditioner, what I use is a brand called Espana Silk, and this is the Espana Silk All Natural Protein Shampoo. I'm going to go ahead and link to this below. It is the best all natural shampoo I have used. It really leaves my dog silky. Um, Lola gets very itchy and she has a lot of skin conditions and they are never bothered by this. I use the Matching Silk All Natural Protein Conditioner. I'll be linking that below as well. And then I also have this. This is a Silk All Natural protein antiseptic healing conditioner. This can be used for dogs and cats. This is great if for whatever reason it's allergy season and Lola seems like she's somehow itching. I always reach for that more antiseptic one to calm down her skin and it works wonders. I will tell you, I don't think that the scent of the Espana Silk is as good as the Isle of Dogs, but I think it's really natural and healthy for your pet and it will leave their coat feeling absolutely fantastic. The first night that I use it, I feel like the scent is a little bit strong, but it is such a great quality product and I love it. Now this is also a product by Espana Silk and as a Yorkie owner that has three very active Yorkies that go outside, I could not live without this. It is an all natural protein waterless shampoo. So if you need to do a little grooming touch up on your dog, you can spray this exactly where you need it and then you can actually just towel dry it and then finish it with a blow dryer or let it air dry and your dog is going to be freshened up. It's amazing. This is great if you have a Maltese as well as I know that they are really hard to keep clean. And lastly, this is a fantastic skin spray. This is by Dr. Dobius, and this is a spray, if your dog is having any skin irritation, you can spray this on your dog. It has worked wonders when Lola had skin irritation. Um, I love Dr. Dobius's products. They are amazing, they're natural, and he is a vet that actually makes his own products that really cares about the products that he uses for dogs. Guys, I really hope that this video was helpful for you. I have been loving sharing my information about Yorkies, and I really just wanted to give you an idea of what I use for my Yorkie grooming supplies. I do get my Yorkies professionally groomed. Oh, look at how relaxed he is. I do get my Yorkies professionally groomed every two months, but each week on Saturdays, they get their own little shampoo and blow dry. Sometimes they just air dry as well. And then I keep up that grooming by brushing them every single day. When I was younger and I had my first Yorkie, I did not groom him enough. And I feel like his little ponytail bothered his head and it was really hard on him. So I have found that as I've had more experience with my Yorkies, I've realized that when you just do a nice grooming every day, it's so much easier on your dog and they're going to look and feel so much better and you're going to have special time together. Please comment below and let me know if this was helpful to you. I will be linking to everything that I mentioned in the video. I hope you guys stay healthy, stay beautiful. Please like this video on your way out and don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Bye guys.